sports events and musical performances used to be held there. Group matches of the 2007 FIFA Women's World Cup were played in the Chengdu Sports Center, a sizable stadium located in the center of Sichuan's provincial capital in southwest China. For their Chinese admirers, international stars like Mariah Carey and Avril Lavigne played here. Until 2013, when an upgrade and renovation revealed relics dating back to the Han Dynasty, 206 BC to 220, up to the Ming Dynasty, 1368 to 1644, right underneath the middle of the venue. It created a surreal but unforgettable view, surrounded by the now still intact seats and roofs of the stadium. The middle of the former field has become a grand excavation site, exposing ancient city walls, streets and canals, houses and gardens, and a palace for kings in the Ming Dynasty, as well as ceramics, coins, and iron and bronze items. After nine years of excavation, the Dong Weiman Historical Site opened to a selected group of local residents on Sunday, December 10. The Chengdu Culture and Tourism Development Group invited around 20 families with small children to visit the site, still under excavation. Archaeologists and scholars were on site to introduce the findings. The Dong Weiman site has been through 21 dynasties, with relics dating back 2,000 years, said Sean Ji Xiong, the former curator of the Palace Museum, via a video speech. Spanning 50,000 square meters, the site proves Chengdu's city site has remained in the same place for over 3,000 years, which is rare in the world. It's a unique archaeological finding, said Sean, it's a vivid manifestation of the pulse of Chengdu. The Dong Weiman site is an integral part of the submission to the UNESCO list of World Heritage Sites of Shudao, translation, the roads to Shu, the ancient mountain road system connecting central and mountainous southwest China for more than 2,300 years. Don Weiman has the potential to fill a blank of core cities of China on the UNESCO World Cultural Heritage List, said Sean. A archaeological park is under construction at the site, the first phase of which will make its debut to the public next year, before the university to be held in Chengdu in July 2023.